Hey everybody, the Tour Striker Impact Strap, some assembly required. There's three pieces. Now, first thing you want to do is take the spacer, and you can see if I sit it down, it's like a ramp. You'll want to take the adjustable strap, and you got to fit it through, fit it through that channel, and wriggle it through until it goes through, and then pull that down. Now, what I want you to do with this strap is go ahead and undo the Velcro that was looped around. And you'll want to kind of season this part by squeezing it because eventually I'm creating a bit of a shape there that's going to match the shape on the shaft. So give that a little bit of a squeeze right there. And then go ahead and undo this because this is going to go around and loop through the other side. And that's what's going to go on your lead wrist. So I'll just Velcro that in place and leave that there. And then I'll take this and put it through this connection here. So you'll see the connector is at the bottom of the wrist strap. So this is how it looks. Now to get it on the golf club nicely, what we're going to do, remember you've kind of formed that, you've bent it a bit, and sometimes when you store it away, just even put the Velcro on so it kind of keeps it rounded off. Now go ahead and put that on the shaft. And it's a little awkward until you get the hang of it. Wrap that around there. That's at the, right at the shaft below the grip. Then the spacer goes on the bottom of the grip. And you're almost done. And then naturally what we're gonna do is put it on our lead hand. Undo a bit of the Velcro. Make sure I don't break anything in the condo that I've rented at the PGA show. And you are ready to go. And that's how you assemble the Tour Striker Impact Strap. And if you do it right, it'll stay on snugly and you can adjust how much tension you want with this adjustment strap right here, the tensioner. So that's how it works.